Okay, and welcome back to another episode of the Complete Solar Run here in Teen Town Written. Uh, so this episode, I'm gonna progress through Daisy Gardens a little bit more, and then grind. Grind my gags, try to... I need to get... At uh, I don't know. I need to get lure at least to level 4, before I, I do anything. Uh, what tax do I have? Okay, I gotta deliver that to spill the beans and then squirt and flour, okay. So uh I feel like I need to talk about UHH more. <laughs> I don't feel like that at all, but that's my go to at this point. Uh you know, I'll talk about this but last all the episodes. As I so I haven't talked about UHH. I don't think so. I honestly don't think it's possible. Oh, you sucked me into your battle. Jerk. I'll lure it. It's like, oh, I was going to train lure. Okay. Well, screw you too, game. What? Uh, oh, give it up. Okay. Try it again. Watch her use tune up. Watch her use tune up. Nope, no tune up. Oh, we got another cog. I'm sick. Kill it. Look, well, he's obviously training lure. I'm not, but. Well, I am, actually. Just help me here. I'm gonna throw a $1 bill. Why do you have drop? Why? <laughs> I'm assuming this isn't your first playthrough of this game. Oh my god. You went tune up and sound? Or not tune up. You went tune up and drop. Why? Why would you do tune up and drop? Why? I understand tune up, okay? I understand I want to get tune up early. Because you, you'll probably max out sound. No, I'm just doing VP. But seriously? Tune up? You went tune up and drop. Lure is... Uh, now granted, my first ever playthrough, I did choose drop before I chose lure. Just stupid. It, I mean, it was... I know out of the two did, I know how, how effective they were. Great, instead of cog building, anyhow. Oh man, a mingler invasion. That'd be great if I need, had the key task. Yeah, I mean, my first playthrough, I chose, I went sound. Well, cause I, I played my friend, okay. I think, I think it's like third, fourth grade, so. I'm in college now. <laughs> Which is how long I'm playing this game. But, yeah. I'm just telling game crash, by the way. <laughs> but, uh. Yeah, my first playthrough, I picked drop. I also played with a friend, who he picked, he he picked tune up. I was like, I think sound's probably gonna be better here than tune up. Like, okay, I went with that. He picked drop over lure, which, yeah, it's like, eh. I mean, drop does a lot of damage, and damage seems to do well. I didn't realize, cause lure has low accuracy. I think. Is the game gonna crash again? It hasn't crashed yet. It just has, it's just not loading. Uh, that's a first. I used to, I used to get this mes message kind of all the time in Two Town Line. I say all the time. It's like maybe once every four hours, but and it was an, it's annoying when you get this message and you're like in a five-story cog building, final floor, and you get this like, well, seriously, 
Now it's just game crashes a lot. So that's interesting. Um, is Toontown down? I'm gonna check see if Toontown's down. Uh, God, she's got to think of the site. It's not even on any of my recent... There we go. Well, no one said anything. On the site, at least. Well, I'll try to log in again, see if anything happens. Okay, it took a few tries, but I've gotten back in, it looks like. Cognition progress. Uh, ambulance chasers? Maybe? Yeah. <sighs> is it a cog building? It is. So yeah. So I chose drop. And I mean, that really was not that great of a decision because I rarely use drop. In fact, I never even maxed drop. I never maxed lure. I think I got dropped to maybe level 3 or 4 on my original Toontown line tune. I think I want to say four, because I think my current one, my current main tune, I call him a main tune, I've played on him forever, but my main tune, I want to say he's at level three drop. I still have maxed blue, I don't think I've got hypno goggles. I don't think I've ever had hypno goggles. Because I just have never trained my gags. I just haven't. Until the solo run here. Where I've, I've trained my gag Jeff. And it, it's, it sucks. I don't, I don't know how you guys do it. I just can't play the game that way. I mean, granted, there's a difference between pushing a gag and training a gag. Uh, training is, you know, going out of your way to fight cogs and using that gag. Pushing a gag is preferring to pick this gag over another type of gag. Uh, did I do pushing? Maybe, I mean, in the factory, I pushed sound. Yeah, that, that, that's about it. I can check see if there was, it was cogular or not. It is. Okay, let's start going down the list and see if it's not cogbuilding on one of these random districts. Oh, and that's the thing that kind of sucks, you know, because, uh, the game, I'm not going to say Toontown written is dead, because it's not. In fact, it's probably just as alive as it's been, but, I mean, it's, you know, besides the initial opening of the beta, but, it's not like you've got let like ten thousand or more people. It's maybe I think that two thousand online right now, maybe if, if that. Granted, it is a school day, and I'd be playing during school time. And uh, I just got a black screen. The game hasn't crashed. I've just got a black screen. But the fact that not a lot of people, are, not a lot of people are playing, makes it. Make more cog buildings. And while, you know, it's a complete slow run, and I don't mind that there's not a lot of people, I mind that there are a lot of cog buildings. So I can't actually do my tasks without defeating a cog building, and I'd rather not do that. I'd rather avoid cog buildings as much as humanly possible. Good what I do. I have. I think I tried the Mingers one. Let's try. I tried that one. Eh. It's only nine people. Yeah, less than a thousand. Granted, it, it is a school day, like I've said. But whatever. So, uh, let's I'm gonna update you guys in UHH. Uh, people are complaining that, uh, Mattis has. Dad has cheated, you know, yada yada yada, without breaking a rule, blah blah blah. Okay. Yeah, that's the UHH update. Um,. Oh, people are still 
requesting a reformat of the entire contest. And yeah, yeah, that's that's your JH. I guess one thing I didn't know, because everyone's called Max An Anderson a he. I'm like, how? Why? How? How are you? Just you just assuming this? Apparently, that was a poker player. Apparently, that guy is a poker player. I think retired. I don't even know how long ago. God, it's still a cog building. Can I just destroy the cog building, please? I'm kind of tempted. Uh, tempted to do it at this point. I don't have max gag. Screw it. Screw it. Let's see how bad this goes. <laughs> Uh, but yeah, apparently like, I play poker, which kind of surprised me a bit. So there you go, it's confirmed that it is a guy. Uh, what do we have here? I am the boss. Cool. A level 5, a level 6, level 3. So because I don't have a group lure, and I don't think group lure would even work. Uh, yeah, that's a great idea, I mean. He has, what, 20 health? I'd say kill him. 6 times 7 is 42, so... I could not kill the... What could I? Is it, is it do 20? Because I know the max of it does 28, I want to say. So am I far enough in throw that I can kill the level 2 in 2 hits? Grant, these are name droppers, but no, I'm not. So let's go up to level. The, ooh, can I? I, I want to try luring them, but I don't think it'd work very well. All right, isn't he charming? Yeah, he's kind of charming. So that is a low. Ooh, ten damage flip. Yeah, we gotta kill this guy quick. Yeah, Lura has low accuracy. Flip odds, uh, do I... Let's throw at him and then calculate the fact that we are wrong here. Well, it hit him, so who cares. 7 times 8 is 56. Don't do 10 damage, please. Do like 2. Well, we're dead. So what we need here is we need to hit him, a miss, I need my lure to work, as yeah, that, we're dead. <laughs> Why didn't I just leave the level 3 alive? Kill the level 6 quicker. Eh. Yeah. Oh. Now let's refill our gags and then swap districts. <laughs> Wait, you can't ride the trailer like you said. That's kind of stupid. I hate that. <sighs> I mean, yeah, if I had a <laughs> lure. <laughs> uh, could I have. S no, I could not have sent him with to victory there. Um, that, I, I hate that. That's kind of stupid. Anyhow, uh, yeah. So on my original Toontown Line tune, I went sound drop. Uh, tune up lure. That's the order I went. And for Toontown Written, I went Sound, Lure, Tune Up, Drop. Because while Drop and Trap are the two most powerful gags in the game, they suck. Honestly, they are terrible. Yeah, it, a lot of damage doesn't really matter if you need help. And if 
I could just use throw, let's say. Like, if I throw two birthday cakes at level 12, it's dead. You know, me and a teammate. Assuming it hits. Or, I could use a sound and piano and kill it. I believe there's actually a higher chance that the two birthday cakes will hit than the sa both the sound and the piano hitting. So, and then trap, trap. While it's perf has perfect accuracy, it's only as accurate as lure is. Because if lure misses, guess what? The trap's not gonna hit. It'll hit next turn, sure, but it won't matter. And lure, not a very accurate gag. It's just not. Seeing which, I need to plant my lure. Uh, that one. How? Okay, never mind. I, I shouldn't complain the game crashed. Uh, ambulance chasers again? Yep. Because this is the district you spawn in, apparently. I don't know, Welcome Valley, or not Vib Vibrant Valley, there we go. I don't know why I'm getting this laugh thing here, because I'm not going to fight another cog. Whew. Do I have a watering set? Do I need that? Do I need to buy that from the catalog? Or do I just come with it? Oh, let's, let's find out. Because more reliable lure wouldn't be a bad idea. And I've... Oh, that's not your home, that's the playground, me. Because I think I've, I've agreed from day one that I was going to organize lure. It looks like I can plant stuff. Uh, I've got eight spots, right? I see two, four, six, seven. I see seven. Two, four, six, seven. I guess you only need seven, but I only see seven. Am I blind? Is there like one on a hill? Two, four, six. Oh, is that one mine? It's gotta be, yeah. Well, oh, that's stupid. Why is it all the way out here? Uh. I don't know. Skirt, we'll just put this one here. Not like it honestly matters, but you planted a one dollar get bill tree. Congratulations. How many times have I walked? Two or three? Three, four, <laughs> five. Okay, now it's just being silly. Come on now. Did they break this? There we go. Christ, that is a lot of watering. Okay. I don't think I've ever watered my plants that much. Whew. 
I guess I've got a large watering can for my main tune, but th th this is a lot of water. Come on. Come on now. I think I'll have seven of them, I guess. <laughs> Okay, no skill up. I'm thinking I'm gonna save these two for hypno and uh, presentation. So let's do this one. Ugh. <sighs> So, I mean, yeah, with this game, I, I would say that you need sound. You need lure. Tune-up? Do you need tune-up? I mean, uh, since there are doodles, yes, you need tune-up. If there were doodles, I th do think that tune-up list might be th the best build in the game. Uh, I could be wrong. I could be wrong because, I mean, tune-up is a good gag. However, you know what you're doing. And you have people with you who know what they're doing. You don't need tune-up. <laughs> you, you don't. Occasionally you get a uh, lure that misses, but past that, it's not really that big of a deal. Come on, not a cog building, not a cog building, not a cog building. Cog building, yay. I'm just gonna go to the flunky one and just take it over, I guess. Oh, I don't want to. Because it's not gonna work. Granted, low five's max. I mean, because I'm not overpowered yet. <laughs> I'm not on pace of where I should be. I need a Cleasel for lure and sound. I didn't do that. I've not done that yet. Once I get lo level 4 lure and sound, yeah, just have level 4 gags all around, uh, I think I'll be able to go through it at least. Uh, Minis Melderland. Not the Burr, that's not the Burr. I probably want max gags. At least max, maxed uh, throw, squirt, and lure. Maybe not max sound, but max sound would help. Wait, is the, is the next choice between... I know it's between tune-up and something. Is that something trap? It's gotta be trap, right? Yeah, it's trap, isn't it? Ugh. See, I'll definitely have four max gags. Probably won't max out trap, because trap is stupid. I hate it. And all it's really going to do is cost me to waste a turn. I mean... That's a two-story cog building. Ugh, fine. Whew. You know, we've made zero progress. <laughs> We've, we've made no progress this episode. Only one flunky, let's hope he's level 3. Not level 6. Not level 6, okay. Yes, the level 6 flunky, because those exist. Yep, totally. Do we rely on lure? Missed. Oh, it actually hit! Oh my god. It actually hit. I don't believe it. I'm gonna get my calculator out here. Cause that'll do what? 13 plus 25? Yeah. So he has 6 times 7. 42. And we did 25 plus 13. Oh, he'll die from a whistle. Wow. 
Wow. Not a bad first floor. So what's the strategy? If we get a level, well, we can't get a level six. A level five, a level five dies in what three hits? Hmm. Well, depends. Is there two? There are two level fives. Do I try a lure? A group lure? I could. I don't know what their max damage is. Hmm. I try lure again. I don't think that uh, that's some kind of luck. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna hit level five with two fruit pies. There goes that strategy. Well, if he does ten, we gotta we gotta try lure. He did three. And this does what six? Yeah. Okay. Well, I mean, we could try lure. Wow. I don't know how we did that, but it worked. Not missed. So, this, uh, I don't know how long, well, he's still swaying, so he's not going to come unlured. So, let's squirt gun him. Alright, that's how the rule works. If the cog's swaying, he will not become unlured. I believe that's, that's how the rule works. No, oh, I thought it was. Well, I guess fruit pie him. Um, I clicked fruit pie. I don't know what you're waiting on. Six damage, okay. Now we need a whistle. We need a bit of luck. How does the whistle miss? Come on, game. Game. Well, I have a group of lures, so I'm kind of dead. <laughs> uh, that kind of sucks. Because yeah, I was going to do him. I should have had enough health left, but I don't. So... Let's go. Everybody misses, essentially. What? What? Hold on. Six times seven is forty-two. Six times seven is forty-two. Okay. Six times seven is not fifty-two. Moron. <laughs> Granted, the whistle shouldn't have missed, but... Oh, well. I'll try it again. I know the car building now. It's low five, and then three more low fives. That's not hard. I need to get lure up. <laughs> Ugh, I need to get lure up so badly. Uh, oh. I think the main problem is I don't want to do the building. I just want to progress the freaking game. And, I mean, granted, it does help to get building, get some experience, you know, figure out what, what gags, combos they needed for each type of cog. But in reality,
reality, I'm going to lure every cog. I can't lure every cog right now because I'm not leveled up enough, which is clear, which is entirely my fault. But I just I don't want to grind. That's that's the only reason why I I don't have I don't have that. So I mean I definitely need level four of every gag I have right now, and then we'll probably do, probably do level four. I want to do level four before for the Hazy Gardens. We're not there yet. Level five for Maze Middle and level six for the Burr. But that's not even true because I need max gags for the Burr probably. So we'll see. I mean, usually in my actual actual runs, uh, I okay. Come on, game. So yeah, you in my other two runs I've done of Toontown. In both Toontown Line, Toontown Written, I've gotten max throw in the Burr. Squirt usually lacks a bit behind, and I usually do progress and sub out a little bit, but therefore my s sound is actually existent. I need gags, right? Because I went sad. Well, I've made zero progress this episode. <laughs> It's just been failing in a building. The flunkies. <laughs> well, mainly because I failed at math, but eh, whatever. Yes, because 25 plus 25 is not greater than 42, apparently, in my mind. That being said, I do need better lure. I'd need better lure before I, I can really do anything. Because, honestly, I don't have the fire rate to destroy cogs yet. To destroy them. You know, on, I don't have firepower to, to outlast them. So I need lure. I will never have the firepower to outlast them. Okay, that's my, that's my new setup. We'll see how long it lasts. So I failed in two buildings so far, one episode. I failed in a one story, which honestly was easier than I made it out to be. Because I killed level 3 first, which I shouldn't, shouldn't have done. I should have went for level 5 first, got level 5 out of the way, then went level 6. Well, maybe maybe level 3. Maybe gone 5, five three six. Cause you can't mind three is doing damage, but yeah. So the plan is what? Do we try the lure on floor one? You try lure on floor one. Uh, I think we might as well. Ooh, I mean it's uh, it's irrelevant. It's irrelevant because it's still gonna take me two hits to kill him. Perfect. He has 42 health, which means I can use a uh, sulfur bottle. Okay. So now we got two fives. I'm gonna just try to outlast these guys, I guess. Kill, kill the one on the right. 
kill the one on the right. Uh, go for the one on the left. And if I'm low on health, which I prob well, I'm not gonna have gags. Am I? Cause uh, 42, yeah, 19. That's not enough. So I'll probably have to lure the second or the third cog comes out. Cause I'm not gonna have firepower. Well, actually, why wouldn't I? Cause I can just seltzer bottle this guy. I will get better at this, I promise. <laughs> it's, I haven't had a whole lot of stra I haven't had to do a whole lot of strategy in this game. You know, by myself at least. Okay. If I do this quickly, I will only get hit once. Assuming this hits. Okay, we're good. So he'll hit me once, he'll join the battle, I will kill the the injured level five. And yeah. So, fruit pie and seltzer. That's how you kill level 5 with these. Okay. Now, I'm not even going to try to tempt fate by using a lure. I should. <laughs> but I'm not gonna. Because, I mean, get a bit of XP up here. I think I get 9 XP for one lure. If this misses, I will. But it's not going to miss, is it? Yeah, no, okay, let's just kill him. No shenanigans, just kill him. Take the building. And boom. That's how you destroy four, four little five flunkies. Fruit pie, uh, seltzer bottle. Fruit pie, seltzer bottle. Fruit pie, seltzer bottle. You're done. 44 experience, Jesus. Do you get double XP in the factory? I don't actually even know. <sighs> Finally, we can press the frickin' game. Greetings, Jeff. What's it, Judge Macintosh say? Oh, right, uh, oh no. Uh, oh, we were right? Oh no. Let's see the blueprints. Hmm. It looks like they construct a factory. Sounds very dangerous. Stay out until you have more laugh points. When you have more laugh points, we will learn much, much more about Subbot HQ. Ah, for now. Here's your reward. You can now carry 35 yags. Wow. Poor reward. Screw it. Let's go to do drop in. I think another reason why I hate just randomly grinding is because there are tasks that are, hey, randomly grind this cog. And I can blow up my gags while I'm doing that, that, but, oh, Elm Street, right? Finn, Hall, Finn End. Oh, they're both on different streets. Let's go to Maple Street first, then. Oh, hey, I'm Sophie Squirting Flower. Uh, I need, uh, 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 your internet to just not work. What's going on with you guys, with TTR servers, guys? Come on, guys. Come on, guys. There's still an ambulance chase, chaser evasion going on. Jesus. Whew. Hey, oh, I have to go to another building. Right. I forgot. forgot about that part, that tiny little detail. Uh, I don't know, I guess I could talk more about my Minecraft PvP experiences. Uh, let's do the first term I was in. Yeah. So, uh, my very first tournament, uh, well, or I should say our team's very first tournament, uh, it was a 4-on-4 four four standard tournament, ba basically. I wait, did I switch districts or did I just go back to the playground? 
I move back to the playground, okay. So it was a four one four. Okay, eight team tournament, single elimination, like all of these are. Uh yeah, you know, the first first match went pretty well before the before the first match, we did a two we did four teams two. This is kinda like a practice form of game. Just you know, figure out, okay. This is how this game works. Oh my god, it's not god wielding. This is how the game works, and yeah. So we did we did that. Uh, I was with Jet Ray in that one. I believe there was a team. I, I, I know Strategist's team was there. Strategist uh, being a guy that eventually I became friends with. As well as T-Dog, Stipeman, Stipe. They were on a team together. And also became friends with those guys. And another random team I don't think I've ever met again. <laughs> I could have. I honestly don't know. But... Uh, so our first match basically came at three on three because none of us could get a four full team of four. Uh, screw you! Another freaking delivery task. Uh. Oh wow! It's not cog building either. So what ended up basically happening was our team, you know, we're mining, mining diamonds, you know, basic strip mining because that's the best way to, to do it and not lose anybody. Uh, granted, health regen is off, or health regen is on, sorry. It's not like a UHC where health, there is no health regen. We have health regen. So, I'm mean, that kind of eliminates, ooh, 10 cogs, days of gardens, eh. So that kind of eliminates uh, arrow combat because arrow combat really, if you take cover, your health's gonna regen. The only time when arrow combat matters is when you're a mile in the sky, which I'll get into that later because there was there was some sky-based warfare as well. Uh, so first match, three on three against T Dog, Snipe Man, Snipe. And one of the friends, I don't know who it was, top of my head. I don't, I don't remember talking to them. In fact, I'm not sure what happened to them, who he even was, so whatever. Uh, basically, what ended up happening was both T Dog and, you know, the third member, uh, they died, I think, probably to a creeper blast and maybe being shot by an arrow, by a skeleton or something. Something stupid like that. Uh, so it was, it was 3v1. We basically surfaced, went up, killed Snipe Man Snipe, and that was the match. Not a very exciting match. Uh, once I reel the game, I will sh I will tell you about match two, but you know this game doesn't work. <laughs>